With Click Catalog, when you onboard data into the marketplace, you do much more than just ingest that data source into the data collection. Under the covers, the Click Catalog onboarding process performs data translation, quality checking, validation, and profiling steps, all aimed at adding an accurate, complete, and thoroughly documented representation of that new data. Let's see how this works by onboarding a flat file of supplier data into Click Catalog from Amazon Web Services Simple Storage Service, better known as AWS S3. Click Catalog includes a set of built-in source data type loaders and wizards that make it easy to add connections for data sources. This includes built-in connectors for flat files, RDBMS sources, JSON files, mainframe applications, XML files, and more. Let's add our new data entity, or table, using the Add Data Wizard. We will add this new set of data to an existing data source connection, which has been previously created to access AWS S3. Click Catalog manages what data each user gets to see through a system of roles, groups, and access privileges. These access controls can be easily synchronized with data and file access controls. Next, we specify the name of the new data entity, point to the source file on AWS S3, and generate the file's data format and column definitions that we will need to onboard this data. The Click Catalog connectors automatically collect and add metadata from the source into the Smart Data Catalog. Or, if no metadata is available to describe the data, you can provide it or it can be inferred from the data itself. So now that we've defined a new set of supplier data, our next step is to actually load the data values into the Smart Data Catalog and Data Collection. When Click Catalog onboards data, it automatically performs a series of data conversions, standardization, validation, and profiling steps. It also processes new data through its rules engine to identify, flag, and act on potentially important patterns in that data. Together, these steps ensure that all data managed is accurate, complete, and thoroughly documented. We can see that the load job finished successfully. It contains 736 rows of data, each specifying supplier data for a particular product. 723 rows were good, meaning they perfectly matched the expected record format and data type. But 13 records had some problems. Let's see what those problems were. It appears the fields such as item name, buyer city, and vendor name have some records with unexpected non-ASCII and control characters. It's possible that we could clean up those bad records using our data preparation module, then reload the data again, and all of the records would then be described as good. Let's take a closer look at the data we just loaded. During the onboarding process, the Click Catalog builds a statistical profile for each field of data. This information is added into the Smart Data Catalog and made available to users via the user interface, as you can see here. This automatic data profiling, combined with record validation, ensures that all data coming into the Smart Data Catalog is always quality controlled, well documented, and transparent to users. Now, this entity can be used in a data preparation job, added to a data set, and published for use with ClickSense and other analytical tools and platforms.